Label the unitized tube and the BD Veritor Plus test device for the specimen to be tested. Place the labeled unitized tube or tubes in the designated area for your workstation or rack until you are ready to process the sample. After obtaining the proper nasal swab specimen, securely hold the tube in one hand while twisting and pulling straight up with the other hand to remove the cap. Fully insert the swab into the unitized tube ensuring that it is immersed in the liquid processing reagent and plunge the swab up and down in the fluid for a minimum of 15 seconds, taking care not to splash contents out of the tube. Remove the swab while squeezing the middle of the tube to capture the optimum amount of sample in the processing tube. Snap fit the tip onto the unitized tube containing the processed specimen. Threading or twisting is not required. For operation in walk-away mode, power on the BD Veritor Plus Analyzer. Immediately after powering on, the analyzer will perform a self-check to verify its operation. For operation in walk-away mode, the analyzer must be connected to the power supply. After the self-check is complete, the display window will show Insert Test Device or double-click for walk-away mode. Double-click the power button. The display window will now show Add Specimen to Test Device and Insert Immediately. To add the specimen, invert the tube and hold it vertically, approximately one inch above the sample well of the test device. The sample well is the small well next to the teardrop mark. Squeeze gently on the half of the tube furthest away from the tip, dispensing three drops of the specimen into the sample well of the properly labeled SARS-CoV-2 test device. Ensuring that full drops are released, not partial drops with bubbles. Note that squeezing the tube too close to the tip may cause the tip to eject and the contents to leak from the tube. After adding the specimen, be sure to keep the test device and analyzer horizontal to avoid spilling the specimen and insert the device into the slot on the right-hand side of the analyzer. The system's unique keyed feature ensures that the device can only be inserted the correct way. Once the device is inserted, the display window will show Do Not Disturb Test in Progress. A countdown timer will display the analysis time remaining. Once incubation is complete, the analyzer will progress through a reading step and an analyzing step. After the analysis is complete, the test results will be displayed. Do not touch or remove the test device until the result has been displayed and documented.